Hello, hello everyone, Serge here with another card opening video. Today we're gonna be doing five wow. uh, dueling mirrors, uh, tints from the one of the latest uh, Yu-Gi-Oh sets that just came out not too long ago. Now, of course, I'm very excited for this set because it has a lot of the original art uh, cards, you know. Uh, I'm a sucker for anything that's like OG Yu-Gi-Oh, right? In this case, the Blue Eyes White Dragon original art. The Dark Magician Girl original art, and even that new uh, Dark Magician Girl like alternative art, um, and a lot of these coming, of course, like quarter century secret rare, uh, secret rare, etc. So I'm very, very excited. If I could get at least one of those uh, three cards, I will be very, very happy. So we have a shot at those cards. Um, I would say we have, you know, a good amount of uh, chances at getting them of course there's one quarter century uh, secret rare guaranteed per pack so if my math does not fail me that's what three six nine twelve fifteen chances not too crazy not too bad at getting at least one of those so as always guys thank you so much for watching like and subscribe if you'd like to support the channel uh visit my website link down in the description below but of course i'll go over that uh, more of that in a little bit but for now let's get into the opening now i'm gonna open one of these tents on the camera just so you guys can see like what's inside like what can you uh expect once you get one of these uh tents from the store and after that i'll probably just uh open them all off camera save uh us all some time and then i uh, just lay out the packs like right here in front of us but yeah this tin looks very very nice very very nice very shiny uh very much a tin of course and boom easy peasy not too much not too crazy of a packaging and then of course we get three packs per tin right three shots per tin at getting one of the cards that we want and underneath this is just emptiness but yeah for now let's uh, take a look at our packs and let's kick this off with this first one. So there we go and Oh, man, I do not remember what all the cars that you can find in this set are But I know there's a couple of them right like SP little knight. There's some meta cards in here. that got reprints Cybers That's a worm. Ooh, limited removal if I'm not mistaken, this is like an alternative art or something like that for limited removal. Like, I do not remember limited removal looking like this in the original. <gasps> oh, <laughs> let's go. Oh, first pack freaking magic, man. Let's go. We got a quarter century secret rare dark magician girl in our first pack. We still got, you know, two more packs from the first 10 and four more tents to go. Oh my lord. Oh wow. Before we get into the other ones, let's see how the centering is. This is really good. Maybe slightly uh, more edge on this side than on that side. But I wouldn't I wouldn't hesitate to send this uh out for grading. Let's freaking go, man. Where are my sleeves? Alright, there she goes in her sleeve. We're gonna put her on the side. And oh boy. I mean, I was expecting something, but not right away. Instant contact, battle royale mode. And yeah, I don't remember, I don't even remember what I was saying before we pulled her. I guess I'll separate all the other cards, put them in a little pile. Anything that's ultra secret or whatever rare and up. And man, well, ah, uh, man, that was the best start we could have had, right? Because if we go like, two or three tens and so far there are no hits that's when i started to get very very worried uh but not this time shatter colorless realm tally ho chaos phantasm what the heck is this earthbound prisoner groundkeeper wanna be oh no i heard this was one of the worst um secret rares you could get not oh, great it looks funny though all right wake up your elemental hero Okay, stand up Centuri Ion and TG Rocket Salamander. Okay, you see, that's more along the lines of what I was expecting from a lot of these packs. Uh, just getting a lot of those cards that probably don't mean too much unless you actually play the game. Then some of these cards might actually be 
somewhat valuable, right? Because uh, I know that some of this, or a lot of these, are reprints and just uh, more affordable, uh, what's it called, like rarity. Start this worm. And Volzar bars. This one looks cool. Ooh, what is this? Black winged dragon. Quarter century secret rare. Okay. Fusion duplication. Combat wheel. And that's about it. All right, and that's the first 10. Wow, okay. First pack magic. So very happy with that 10. That 10 basically just paid for itself already with that first hit without even considering everything else that we got. Uh, so yeah, let me open up all the other 10s, lay out all the packs right in front of us, and we'll keep going. And okay, we're back. So here are the three packs of each 10. 10, 10. Uh, that way we know uh, we're not getting any clumping. That way we know these are all each individual uh, tins that we're opening per se starting off with the first 10 okay bio insect armor chaos beast number on creation shell of chaos ashura king Ooh, this one's cool hita the fire chandelier but it says chandelier for a second oh chaos ancient gear giant Happy, Guidance of Horus, and Starring Knight. Hmm. So, of course, like I know the cards that I am chasing, uh, per se. Uh, my apologies if I get a really big hit that I have no idea it even is a big hit. All I know is like, you know, SP Little Knight, you know, the ones I just mentioned, like Blue Eyes, Dark Magician Girl, etc. Uh, but yeah, I don't know exactly all the other big hits that we can get. Ooh, I mean, is this a big hit? Sure looks big. Guncon Shuship. <laughs> Shari Red. That's a funny name. Visas Amritara. I mean, all these cards look cool as hell, though. Their art is very, very nice. First Movement Solo. Hmm, I don't know. I mean, is this a good card? To me, it doesn't look that great. Apparently Plump. Maybe if I read what they do, maybe it'll be like, oh, this actually sounds pretty OP. Uh, but in the world of Yu-Gi-Oh, honestly, what is an OP at this point, right? And the last pack from that first 10, let's see. All right. Card Scammer. Scanner? Scammer? Total Tally Ho. Schmall Scuffle. Oh, there's IP Mascarina. So nice. Emergency! Exclamation point. Ooh, okay. I think this is a good one, right? I opened some of the, uh, oh, what's it called? Well, I mean, one of the sets where this card came out, uh, like last year. And this card was like a $40 card. It was pretty expensive. So, very nice hit. <gasps> Let's go, boys! Oh, my lord. A wanted and a blue eyes white dragon quarter century secret rare. That's it. We got two of the three that I said I wanted. <gasps> Is this a sign? Can we go? Can we actually get all three of them? How's the centering? Oof, not great. A lot more skewed on that side than on this side. I don't know if I would still send this out for grading, honestly. That top corner is kind of scuffed. If at least that top corner was more like this lower one, I don't know. To me, it looks like it's kind of crooked to the side. Uh, but nonetheless, we got a quarter century seeker rare. Blue Eyes White Dragon original art. That's honestly like perfect at this point. Two tents, you know, that was the last pack of the second tent that we got. And we're two for two. I didn't even bring this the, <laughs> the sleeves because honestly I wasn't expecting on getting another one of the ones that I was hoping to get. Alright, baby. Let's freaking go. This is amazing. So far we're absolutely killing it third 10 technically Let's see what we can get at this point man the odds that we can get one more of at least blue eyes or dark magician girl uh the odds are pretty pretty good not gonna lie loca synchro world tribe brigade arms bucefa fafahalus Ooh. I mean, I, I remember that card being maybe slightly valuable. I don't know, maybe it was like a dollar or five dollars or something. Ooh, 
I think this is another decent one, right? Nope. Quarter century secret rare scapegoat. I can't imagine you guys being like, nah, dude, that's a 50 cent card. Or like, bro, that's a $50 card. Oh my goodness. Chimera Fusion. And Jen the Diamond Tiger. Hmm. Interesting. Much, much better um, opening than I thought it was going to be, at least for me in this case. Super Heavy Samurai Stealthy. UFO Light. Tele Ho Ho. Ashura King. These have like multiple heads. Yeah, it has three heads. Ooh, oh baby, is this another one? I know, dude, okay, I don't play Yu-Gi-Oh, but you know, I somewhat stay in the loop, right? This was a very sought after card, right? Bonfire, if I'm not mistaken. Oh man, I don't know, for some reason I saw like, effect, and I was like, Dark Magician Girl again? Uh, we just get a good old green gadget. Ooh, wow, this card looks so pretty, man. Nini, the Mirror, Mikanko. This is my first time seeing this art, I think. And a memento me missi talon. And that's about it. Branded in Central Dogmatica. I can call Spirit Wall. XYZ. Vanguard. Ooh, this one looks cool. Burning Dragon. Ooh, wow. Okay, this is the first time seeing this art too. Okay, what did we get? Fusion. Ooh, okay. I mean, I'm a big fan of this card from the anime at least. XYZ Dragon Cannon uh, QCSR. And there you go, another uh, fiery king card. No pendant. Well, I think we got some very decent cards from that third tin. Obviously, no blue eyes or dark magician girl, but very, very decent. Uh, I guess like. You know, relatively valuable cards as well. So, I don't know. I feel like we made our money back from that third tin as well. Pendulum Moon. XYZ and Trust. Manticore. Chaos Witch. Ooh, another waifu Yu-Gi-Oh card. Boom. Can we get more of this Yu-Gi-Oh, please? Yeah, The Primal Being is not that happy. Let's see. Oh, man. Coach King. Hmm. I don't know. If I had to guess... Ooh, yes, Yu-Gi-Oh, we need more of this. You'll see your sales completely skyrocket. Just a whole set of like Dragon Maidens, you know, Dragon Maids. That would be amazing. Gigantic Thunderclock. Ooh, this one looks pretty too. Wow, so many of Yu-Gi-Oh stepping up their art with the waifus, man. Inchi Kaimei, Forge and New Future. Triple Tactics. I mean, was Triple... I mean, that sounds very familiar. Triple Tactics. Is this a different art as well? That looks very cool. We got it for QCO, QCSR. That's awesome. Galaxy Eyes, Cypher Dragon. If I'm not mistaken, that's another, you know, decent hit. I guess. But you never know, right? Like, nowadays I go into TCG play or something, and then all the cards are worth, like, 50 cents, bro. It's crazy. Pharaonic Advent. Ooh, Chimera. More support for the Chimera stuff. Lucian Beast. And there you go. Giant Ball Game. And last pack of the fourth tin, baby. Okay. Branded. Core of Chaos. UFO Light. Magnetium. My Mesis Elephant. Ooh, Ice Jade. Gimmer. Agirine. Uh, Ooh, okay, not the best. I think I've seen this card and it's just like whatever. Ooh, Rescue Ace Fire Engine. Ooh, that's cool. Midnight Philly. That's about it. What the <laughs> Imagine a deck full of these cards. Man, it's gonna be trippy as hell. All right, that was probably the weakest tin so far. Uh, who knows, maybe I did pull something crazy. I guess we'll find out later. But last 10. Last 10. We started off super strong with the two cards. With two of the three cards that I was uh, mostly looking for. So can we close it out with the third card that I was hopefully uh that I was hopeful I would get, which is the Dark Magician Girl Alternative Art. Daida Daidara Bochi. Ooh, invocation. That looks so sick. Holy crap, Aroni. 
Oh, damn. It's probably not the best one. Uh, QCSR that you can get. Uh, a pearly happiness. Damn, this looks cool. A lot of these cards, even though I want to say their name, I just know I can't. I'm like, bruh, nah. Do yourself and everyone else a favor and just, like, keep going. Okay. Click and echo. Or dolphins. Cyanide circuit. New frontier. Uh, super heavy samurai motorbike. Oh my god, can this be an SPD? Little Knight? Oh no, but it's uh, original Sinful Spoils. I think this one's a decent one, maybe, perhaps? Ooh, there you go. Okay, at least this is a somewhat personal favorite. You know, of course, it's from the anime. Who's not gonna want a seal of Oricalcos? This is awesome. This looks so, so nice. Labyrinth Wall, Shadow. Oh my god, dude. This card also brings back memories. It's awesome. Kayore Getsu. And that's it for the second pack of the last 10. Can we end it up with last pack magic? So far, I would say, honestly, I'm just, I'm already happy with what I gotten. So all this is literally just the cherry on top. Tenchi Kamei. Maze Attraction. Okay. SP Little Knight, or I believe the next card should be or should take the space of um, the Dark Magician Girl or the SP Little Knight. So here goes nothing. Oh, oh it's a spell. Oh my god, it's a, it's a pendulum, even worse. God damn pendulums, man. I think this is when I officially checked out of Yu Gi Oh! with pendulums. Okay, for QCSR. All right, that's not too bad. Relinquish Hanima. And this is really cool. I don't even know if Relinquish got any support. I've never really even seen anyone talk about it. This is really cool. Ooh, Golden Cloud Beast Malone. And a Cassie Molar. A Devil Doggy. And that's about it. So there you guys have it. Hope you guys enjoy that. Let me know down in the comments below if there were any cards that I got that were actually high value and I didn't really even notice and how your pulls uh, went as well if you opened any of this uh, Dueling Mirrors tints because I've seen a lot of like different uh, sorts of hits that people have gotten. Some people get really lucky. Some people truly score Jack, you know, shenanigans. And so yeah, a slightly irregular but uh, yeah, let me know down in the comments below. And please, as always, guys, if you like this video, like and subscribe. Uh, check out my uh, online shop down in the description below. Most of these cards that you see me pull on all the videos that I make will most likely end up getting graded. At least the big ones or the ones that look decent. And so, yeah, you can always expect to see those cards in the shop, you know, a couple of months after I pull them. After they come back to me from being graded. But thank you guys as always so much for watching. Hopefully I'll see you guys in the next time. And yeah, have an awesome rest of your day. See ya.